What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Honeybee, back to deliver another daily buzz for you guys. Welcome to my new subscribers. Welcome back to my returning subscribers, my day ones. Those of you who have been rocking with the honey pot from um, the beginning, I appreciate you guys also very much. Cross watches, you are welcome here as well. If you just so happen to stumble across our video or this channel and you see something that you like or here, feel free to join our colony by hitting the subscribe button down below. You may also hit the notification bell, you guys, so that you can be notified when I do upload content to the channel. As always, tell a friend to tell a friend. I do offer personal readings, you guys. If you are interested in any personal readings, check the description box down below. My contact information is listed there. We're going to go ahead and dive right into the reading. Let's see what the universe, the divine, wants us to know on today. Let's see what kind of energy is buzzing around my collective. Sending you guys good energy. Um, to those of you who send me great energy to my collective as well as myself, I return that to the ten sender tenfold. To those of you who are sending me evil eye, I re return that to the sender tenfold as well. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what the overall energy is for this reading. Let's get some messages out. What, what kind of energy is buzzing around my collective spirit? What does, oh, madness. It says foolishness here. About to do something crazy, losing their cool. So, okay. So, wow. Okay. So, this person, uh, they're losing their damn mind. Whoever it is that you're dealing with or here or not dealing with, someone is about to make a very reckless decision. Um, This could be you or this could be your person. If this is you, you guys, like just, just don't. Someone is losing their cool. Like you may be out here enjoying life, being successful, being happy, um, going out with friends. You may be in a new connection, right? Is what I hear. Someone may be moving on from a past person, and this person is thinking of taking action. But this, it don't seem like. This seems like something sinister, like off the wall. Like look at this card. This person almost looks like they have evil in their eyes. Like this person, I hear filled with rage. This person is full of rage. Um, sadness is also here. Feeling pessimistic, pessimistic and helpless. This person is in a negative mind frame. Um, they want things to change. They feel guilty. They feel regret. Like I feel like this is someone that you pulled your energy away from. And this person may be someone who is used to you coming back. Or they are used to being able to apologize to you and it will win you back over. But I feel like this time you're standing your ground with this person. And it's, it's making this person, I hear, insane. Like, they're going insane. Like, this person, like, they may feel like you're testing them at this time. Oh, wow. They thought what they thought, what they thought was going to happen, you guys. Like, they thought... The connection, they thought this uh, this separation between you and them was going to be short-lived. Yeah, look, temporary. Temporary. But just know, like, it says you're protected, right? As you make this transition away from this person. Because this person is unstable. They're in, they're in, it says instability. This person is not stable. This person is having some very, very devious, reckless thoughts. I hear heinous. This person may also be frustrated with their living situations. Like, it's, it's unstable. Like, you, you may have put this person out. And that's what I'm saying. You may have put this person out or to put this person out of your energy if this is not someone that you are living with. And, like, this person, they're about to do something crazy is exactly what this card reads. Foolishness. Losing their cool. Like this person. Hmm. Losing their marbles. Wow. Yo, this is very. This is. It's almost eerie. It's giving me an eerie feel. Yeah, look. Good outcome changes. Destiny. Fate. Good, good luck. Cycles of love. And this is you. Wherever you are, you're having, you're, um, having good, good luck. 
good fortune in your life at this time but it's it's all because you have turned a blind eye you turned away from this person let me say this energy y'all i don't like this it almost feels sinister. Whoever this is sending this, this type of energy to my collective. Return to the sender tenfold spirit. Keep us protected. Keep my tribe. Keep my colony protected. Y'all make sure you're doing your return to senders. Make sure you're keeping yourself protected and lifted in prayer. Um, This person is sad. Like not only they're, they're sad for thinking this way. Um... But this person is they're sad. Like this is a sad case. Like when you have to think of literally going out and trying to harm someone because And this is the killing part, y'all. They did something to you. Like if they wouldn't have did whatever it is that they did, like you would have never you know what I'm saying? Or done multiple times. I feel like this is this person's pattern. Like, you know, especially with the will being here, like it's an ongoing cycle and you finally decided to close the cycle and now this person can't take it. Like this person may also be drinking. This person may have a drinking habit. Like when they get drunk, this person may do reckless things. And then they may li later live to regret it, right? And I feel like this person is also always used to you taking them back. And I feel like this time, like you're like you're not accepting their sorrow because like an apology without change behavior is manipulation. Like this person is manipulative. And it's like now they, they feel in some type of way because they can't manipulate you anymore. Like they feel like like they it, it's run its course. I feel like you're over this person. This person cannot get over this. They're having a hard time letting you go. Like this person, um, look, up in the air, nothing set in stone, unresolved, undecided, in limbo, uncertainty, unclear. Like, you know, this person may have reached out, like they may have texted you or reached out and tried to apologize. And you could have left this person on raid or you could have this person blocked, you know. And this is why, like, this person don't know what you're thinking at this time. Like, this person is beginning to lose their cool. It says here, hesitant, ashamed, embarrassed, self-conscious. Like, it's eating this person alive. Look, round and round. Like I said, going in circles, wasting time, achieving little, talking without deciding. Like, this is someone, like, they had a whole lot of mouth. But when it came to backing up what it is that they would say, this person, they couldn't. They had this person, someone who like follow through. Like I said, like they would apologize and oh, I'm going to change. I'm going to be different. Watch things will be different. You'll see. But then when all was said and done, when this person felt you felt like they had you back in their good graces, this person will right, go right back to doing the same old bullshit. Like this is somebody they talk about it, but they don't be about it. Like this, this person don't walk. They talk. This is a talker. This is somebody who's all talk. They full of gimmicks. Like this is somebody that'll sell you wolf tickets. Like, you know, this is somebody like. They played you for a joke. Actually, now the joke is on them. This person is feeling foolish. Like, they're feeling like a clown. Like, this person is a, is a bozo. But, y'all, be careful with this person. And I say something crazy. Like, this person may show up in, at your house. Like, this person may try to strong arm you. Like, you know, like, this person may be drinking their self into a, a slumber. Like, you know, it's like they're trying to escape life. This person also has a lot of bad habits. Like, they could have a drinking problem. Gambling addiction is what I hear. Um, this person could be addicted to drugs. They could just be addicted to toxicity. This is someone who, who lives a toxic lifestyle. Like, this person is addicted to toxicity. Right? Look, like I said, it's someone that you left out in the cold with this five of pentacles. This is someone you left out in the cold. Like, this is who the, whoever it is that you left out in the cold. Like, this person is, they're losing their shit. They can't think straight. Like, this person is not thinking straight. They can't see past go. Like, this is where this unstable energy is coming in. Like, this person can't see past go. Like, they want to come in. They want to come in and want to celebrate with you. But this person is not even what they what they be talking about. And also, like, protect your finances as well. So, for some of you, you have some good coinage that's coming in. Like, you have a brand new offer. This, for a lot of you, this could be a means of, of making money. Like, you know? Or, like, your money is just looking good at this time. Like, this person feels on the outside. They feel like they're on the outside looking in. And rightfully so. And, like, with this will turning in your favor, with good outcome, changes, destiny, fate, good luck, cycles of love, this has been a long time coming for you. I feel like what you had to do was, all you had to do was, once you released this person, like, the will started turning in your favor. For a lot of you, this, this person is what had you stuck. This person was really holding you back. This person was holding you back. What is this sadness energy? Why is this sadness energy here, spirit? 
this person is sad like they want to come towards you and they want to apologize but for like i said this person um they know they owe you an apology but listen it's fake <laughs> this person is not gonna change like you're not accepting this a person's apology this is why they're sad like because they they for a lot of you they reached out like they tried to apologize and you you shut the door on this person like you know like yeah this time i love you but this time i love me more like this person is not used to you choosing yourself over them they're used to you putting the your love you have for them before the love that you have for for yourself they can't take it like this person is growing frustrated they're getting angry like i said here like with this um this madness card it says about to do something crazy this is could be an irrational energy like you could be dealing um you have earth energy and you have water energy you have swords energy this could be anybody y'all like you know like the sign don't matter like anybody could could be in this energy this person is is frustrated like they're getting frustrated and i feel like when this person drinks it angers them so whatever this person does this irrational way of thinking or this something crazy that's coming to pass like this person may show up at your house or they may show up where it is that you are so be, make sure like you you know you're aware of your surroundings like you know like if you can't don't go out by yourself like make sure you have someone around you you know are with you because like i feel like this person will not hesitate like you know if they catch you in a vulnerable vulnerable position if this person will catch you off guard like they will make a move towards you whatever that move may be like be careful with this person like apology is here like this apology wants forgiveness regret their action wants to make up but for a lot of you like i said you cast judgment look you cast judgment on this person your judgment is to end a connection like to put an end to this two of cups because all this person did was backstab you and betray you like it's like you could never find no happiness in this connection it was always round and round and round like the situation was always up in the air with this person like that apology don't work no more like this person wants to come back and they want to try to um they want to try to win you over but their actions never change and like i said you know apology without change behavior is just manipulation this person is manipulative as hell and like when this person when they can't wield um when things don't go in their favor like this person they get angry like you know this is not somebody who's who's sorry like you know this up in the air here spirit is advising you to move forward six of swords this is divine guidance and protection like they want you to know that you will be protected and guided and like moving forward away from this person right here. this is about fast action fast movement like get away you know and for a lot of you like once you start moving forward and you you begin to heal like you you're going to have a lot of good things that come in for you things that that have been had been delayed they're going the will is going to start to turn in your favor look ten of pentacles ten of pentacles like let this person sit over here i feel like what has been happening all this time like you kept giving in and feeding into this connection you were blocking this person's karma look it's time for the tower to fall on this person like this is the tower moment going in circles wasting time achieving little taking talking without deciding like this is this it's time for you to put an end like you know like the tower doesn't this, this person is going through tower moments but the tower moment here for you is just walking away you know especially when something is not built on a stable foundation like sturdy foundation like this this connection could have started off all wrong you know but you you bypass the red flags like i feel like you saw the red flags this person you know they they could have hit it pretty well but at some point the red flags did start, start to show and what you did was you blinded yourself to this because you wanted to see the good in this person or in this connection like you really wanted this to work but it's not working and it hasn't been working in a long time like you know oh wow you know when the tower comes around like it doesn't have to be look that's all i about to say it doesn't have to be anything bad like you know like the tower comes when you need to eliminate a situation so for you the tower moment is walking away from this connection tearing down that whole foundation and then you have a brand new slab to rebuild over and what you're going to be rebuilding is the sun like you could never find happiness and stability in this connection like you know like it's like this person they may have made you feel like they were uninterested in anything more than what it was like this person they they for a lot of you this person could have been with you for monetary gain like this person could have been with you for monetary gain like you know like because of what you had this person was uninterested in a cup this person was uninterested in love why they're so frustrated right now is because they don't have access to 
money for some of you. This person really stunned your growth. Like it was time for you to put an end to this connection. And I feel for a lot of you, you hesitated putting an end to this connection because you really love this person. Like you have feelings, like your feelings were involved. You were invested, but this person wasn't invested in the same way um, that you were, right? And like, I feel like for some of you, you're going to, this person is going to be coming towards you, um, bringing in an offer. But look what's hidden behind this, this Knight of Cups. Like, you know, and keep in mind what I say about knights, y'all. Knights are fly by night. They're fly to energy. Now you see them, now you don't. As quick as they come in with a loving energy, they're going to go back to their deceptive ways. Like, this is a trick. It's a pawn. Like, you know, this person is trying to trick you. Like, don't hesitate. They don't want you to hesitate any longer putting an end to this connection. If you 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 take this person back, you give in to this, this offer, this person is only going to deceive you because this is what they're coming back. Hidden. This is what's hidden behind this cup. It's trickery. It's trickery. This person can also be um addicted to your energy. Yeah, and I said, right as I say, addicted to your energy, I look down and here's the Empress card because you're abundant. Like, you know, like you can make shit happen for yourself. And Spirit said, that is the damn truth. Like, you don't need this person. You do not need this person. And you know what? They know you don't need them. And this is this is why it bothers this person. Like, this person wants, they, they want you to want them. Like, they, they want you, they want some, they want for you to be dependent on your energy, be, on their energy, because they're dependent on your energy. But Spirit is telling you to heal. Look, you have two cards of healing. Just heal. Like, heal from this situation. Heal from this heartbreak. Put an end to this connection. And watch how all your dreams come true. They want you to keep hope and be positive. Like, your justice is right around the corner but it's going to require you to leave this connection like you know i hope this helps y'all see you on the next video bye